This video is for two types of guys who want to know how to deal with a breakup. The first type of guy is the one who wants to move on from the breakup, but can't. And the second type of guy is the one who wants to get their ex back. Which of the two types of guys are you? No matter which type you might belong to, here's some good news for you. The solution is the same. The solution, as this video will show you, is mind control. Now, I'm not talking about the hokey Hollywood kind of mind control. Instead, I'm talking about the scientific, fact-based, peer-reviewed kind of mind control. It's the kind of mind control that gets rid of all your fears and doubts, and puts you in total, complete control of your life. Want to move on from your breakup? Mind control will let you do that in an instant. Want to get your ex back? Mind control will also let you get her back. No matter what it is you want, you're about to learn how mind control will help you achieve it. It's all in this video, so buckle up. You'll love what you're about to learn. Before we get started, I need a quick favor. Please scroll down and click the like button real quick. It'll mean the world to me, and it'll just take you a couple of seconds. So please take those two seconds now and click like. I'll wait. Done? Great. Let's move on. Let's start by tackling the root of the problem. So first of all, why do breakups hurt so much? Here's a clue. It's not because you lost a woman. Here's another clue. It's not because you're less of a man. None of those are the reason why breakups hurt so much. Instead, the reason why breakups hurt is one thing. The loss of control. You felt like you lost control over a very important area of your life. And whenever you feel a loss of control, it necessarily means you lost power. And losing power? That cuts deep for men like us. That's because deep down inside, we've been hardwired by Mother Nature to be leaders. Being good leaders, even if we're just leaders of our own individual selves, gives meaning to our lives. That's at the core of manhood. But here you are. You failed at keeping your relationship together. Deep inside, you feel you failed as a man. And that's why breakups hurt so much. So what's the solution? Easy. You'll need to get back in control. You need to put yourself back into a position of power. How exactly do you do that? Answer, with mind control. And that, my friend, is how to deal with the breakup and emerge as a stronger, better man. Believe me. Okay, for now, let's switch gears and talk about how mind control can put you back in control and in a position of power, starting with the first situation. Let's say you're hurting from your breakup, but you want to move on. How do you use mind control to move on from a breakup? Okay, so here's your situation. You had a bad breakup, and you feel torn to pieces over it. You want to move on, but for some reason, you can't stop obsessing over your ex. What's going on? Answer: You have what the science of mind control calls scarcity mentality. Your brain believes that there are very few women out there who would love you. And it believes that you actually found a woman who loved you, but you lost her. And now it thinks you'll never find another woman who would love you again. Now, is any of that true? Of course not. At any given time, there are hundreds of women out there who would love to be your girlfriend. It's just that you haven't met any of them yet, and your brain is too fixated on the one that got away. So if you want to move on, you'll need to replace your scarcity mentality with an abundance mentality. That is, you make yourself see that there are hundreds of women out there for you. How? Well, I recommend you use this approach, popularized by the mind control expert Derek Rake. You can call it IRA, or Intrigue, Rapport, Attraction. The first step is intrigue. Here, you make as many new female friends as you can. You can do it by meeting friends of friends, or by expanding your career network, or by approaching strangers who look interesting. The second step is rapport. You now deepen your relationship with your new female friends. Using mind control, you make them feel a much deeper connection with you than with anyone else they know. The third step is attraction. Here, you take your female friends who like you the most and take things to the next level. If a woman really likes you, she'll gladly become your new lover. Now here's what happens when you use this approach. Many of the girls you approach will remain strangers to you. And it's not your fault. Sometimes they're just not interested, or they're too busy, or they're already taken. No big deal. But some women will become good friends with you. And among them, there will be a few women who will have feelings of romantic attraction towards you. 
and among those precious few, you can choose your favorite girl and start a new relationship with her. That's how it works. Now, if that sounds a bit complicated, don't worry about it. At the end of this video, I'll show you to an exclusive resource from Derek Rake himself that will show you how it's done. So be sure to watch till the end of this video. Oh, and one more thing. If you haven't already, please scroll down and click the subscribe button. Having you as my subscriber would greatly motivate me to make even more videos like this for you. So please take a few seconds to click subscribe now. I'll wait. Done? Awesome. Now let's help the second group of guys out. Their problem is, how do you use mind control to get an ex back? Let's say you had a woman in your life, but you lost her. Now you want her back, but you have a problem. Either she doesn't want you back, or she already has a new boyfriend. What should you do? First of all, you'll need to know that all is not lost. You can still get her back, even if right now she doesn't want you back, and even if she has a new man in her life. How exactly do you do that? Easy, by making her want to come back to you. And you do that with, you guessed it, mind control. When you're trying to get an ex back, Derek Rake suggests a different approach. This one's called the DCE approach, or Disarm, Confuse, and Enslave. First, you disarm your ex by doing the exact opposite of what she expects you to do. For instance, if she's expecting you to keep begging her to come back, then you disarm her by suddenly going one whole month with zero communication. Secondly, you confuse her with mind control. After disarming her, you re-establish contact and treat her like an old buddy again. Then you use mind control to make her feel attracted to you again. The key is to keep your intentions hidden. The more she wonders what you're up to, the more she'll fantasize about you, and the more she'll miss you. And thirdly, you enslave her by making her fall in love with you again. Only this time, she'll be so in love with you that she'll never let you go again. If you want to get your ex back, then that's the general approach you'll need to take. Disarm her, then confuse her, then enslave her. It's all mind control from start to finish. Now, of course, I can't give you all the details about mind control and its techniques in a single video. There's just not enough time for me. But that's why I have something even better for you. In just a moment, a link will come up on the video. It's a link to Derek Rake's online masterclass on mind control. In his masterclass, mentalist Derek Rake will teach you how to become a master of mind control. When you're a master of mind control, it won't matter what you want to happen. Whether you want to find a new girlfriend using the intrigue, rapport, attraction approach, or if you want to get your ex back using the disarm, confuse, and slave approach, as a master of mind control, you can do anything you want because you're back in total control and you're back in a position of power. Want to get back in control? Want to reclaim your power? Then be sure to click the link and sign up for Derek Rake's online masterclass on mind control. Do it now.